12th anniversary of Screaming Eagle, uh, Heritage Softail Classic, 117 cubic inch, 130 horsepower, 133 pounds of torque, with bagger, long pipe, diamond cut heads and cylinders, 21 front end, street custom, stock motorcycle. It's got a D&D long pipe on it, saddleback liners, I'm Ron Castor, and that's Sergeant Duke. He's the mascot for the Marine Corps out of Pensacola, Corporal Spears. And this bike is a tribute to the uh, all military people that uh, served our country, that gave their life and fought for our freedom. Uh, inside the paint job, there's uh, 12 hidden direct MOSs, such as uh, uh, landing craft. Uh, there's several all the way around. There's a flamethrower, infantry, uh, helicopters, corpsmen's. Uh, tried to represent as many military services that we could as far as the MOS's. It's got the tribute on the back for all of them. And then I put the full size fallen soldiers on the back to represent everybody that are the true heroes of our country. And uh, we just enjoy coming, going around and showing the bike, going different places. And hopefully people get the joy out of uh, seeing the bike and uh, seeing what we're trying to uh, do as far as put the word out there to member our vets uh, that has taken care of us in the past and in the future. American Mild category, which is sponsored by U.S. Rider News. American Mild, bike number 22, Eva Sabone. Eva Sobone. Third place. Third place. Second place in American Mild, bike number five, Michael Calvinzo. Place, which you get a $50 gift card from Best Western, is bike number 31, Ashley Jackson. Ashley brought his uh, cheering section. In American Wild category, which is sponsored by Kiriakin, goes to Cherokee Callahan. Cherokee Callahan. All right, in the first place in American Wild, Kiriakin American Wild goes to bike number seven, Too Tall. And I can see why they call you Too Tall. And I'll tell you something about Too Tall. He came up earlier and said, somebody knocked over my bike and broke it or dented a few things. And uh, it was obvious that it just happened. So 
we convinced him to go ahead and put the bike in that he might have a chance to win anyway. All right, metric, one metric wild class. We only had uh, one bike, and that, of course, he won. That would be Eugene Wooldred, bike number 18. Yeah. I shouldn't have said that, because that just makes it look bad. It makes it sound like he didn't have any competition. So we had uh, second place, bike number 40, Ryan McLaughlin. Sea sport Ryan McLaughlin. A sport bike mild. Oh yeah, yeah. If we have, we, but we don't have a brush sponsor on this category. A sport bike mild. Uh, this is the uh, Harry bike. Bike number ten, Gary Devaney. All right, in Bagger Mile, third place in Bagger Mile goes to Randall Yates. Randall Yates. Second place is Bob Jones, bike number 28. Bob Jones. First place in Bagger Mile, Jason Harrison. Jason Harrison. Now, of course, none of these baggers were very mild or wild, but... Freddie picked it, uh, I don't exactly know how he did that, but, okay, this is Custom Dynamics, the Bagger Wild class is Custom Dynamics. Third place is Kelly Wright, Kelly Wright, bike number 27. Second place in Bagger Wild, bike number 21, 29, Brent Moore, Brent Moore. Brent, are you here? All right, first place, first place, Bagger Wild, John Creekmore, Creekmere, John Creekmore, Creekmere. I don't know why I struggle with your name every time. That was uh, bike number 15. Custom Dynamic $500 gift certificate. Bike Mild category. Third place, Beth Kasner. Beth Kasner. Second place, Trike Mile, Jim Harvey. Jim Harvey. And in first place in Trike Mile is Ronald Kasner. Ronald Kasner. Excepting for Ronald is his uh, bulldog. Oh, he left his bulldog over there. Trike Wild. Third place in the Trike Wild division, bike number nine, Nicholas Scoutrice. Scoutris. Is that how you pronounce it, Nicholas? Scoutais. Scoutais. I knew that. I was just seeing if you did. Second place in Trike Wild, bike number 14, Kezra Templeton, or Temple. Kazira Temple. Is that how you say it? Kazira Temple. Close enough. And first place in Trike Wild, which is sponsored by RC Components Trike Wild First Place, which is a $500 gift certificate, goes to Bud Strine. Bud Strine. Five hundred dollars from RC Components. And in the Antique Mile class, Antique not uh, Antique, pretty much close to stock or stock. Second place in that would be Rob Casson, bike number thirty-nine. Rob Casson. And first place in that, bike number thirty-four, Harold Proctor. Harold Proctor. Over there. Uh, antique semi custom at uh, those bikes that are pretty close to custom but not customized or not uh, stock, I mean. Third place in that would be Harold Proctor. Harold Proctor, bike number 36. Harold brought a couple bikes, right? Yes, sir. Thank you. 
stay at that point? Second place in that category is bike number six, Richard Shaughnessy. Richard Shaughnessy. Richard would be uh, Norwegian with a name like Shaughnessy, right? Alright, third, uh, first place in that category, bike number 16, Billy Franklin. Billy Franklin. Alright, in the rat bike category, uh, he knows who he is. Is he here? <laughs> Come on up, Dave. He's the uh, only red bike. Dave wins. And Dave, you win a custom... It's about time. You win a detailed... <laughs> oh, no, 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 no. <laughs> Wait a minute. That's not the red bike. That's radical. No, that's radical. That's not red bike. You're red. Sorry. Look at the difference in the, in the two oh, trophies. <laughs> that one's been a little more scraped up. Okay, I got a large. Alright, we're going to make sure he gets one, so we're giving him a large. Yeah, we should we should rip it a few times and cut some holes in it. I'll take care of that. Yeah. It's hard to get rat bikes in. Drag it behind the bike for a while. Well, I know you probably will. You, you, if it's like your bike, you won't wash it for a couple months, and it'll be just right. God does that. Damn my wood, but my favorite one was bike number 19, David Johnson. The best of the beats. Steel Horse Law, best of the beats last year was over. That's it. They're giving out all the awards. Uh, the winners are collected their uh, prizes and their shirts. They get ready to leave. We've got a great time. We hope you guys have enjoyed it too. Thunder Beach is winding down. The night's the last party. And, uh, and then it's back home, back to the real world. But remember, we'll be right here again in the spring for the 2013 Best of the Beach series. We hope you guys have come down. We have some great prizes. We've got about $15,000 in, in total prizes, gift certificates, and cash. If you guys want to get here with your bike, Pier Park on the last Saturday at Thunder Beach for the uh, Best of the Beach bike show. All right, we'll see you then. Y'all be safe.